All right, here's a look at stage seven from the Open PCC Nationals 2024. Fun stage. I had some gun issues. They were all resolved after the stage. Didn't have any more after that. Uh, but a fun stage. Still executed well, even with the malfunctions. Here we go. All right, fun little stage. A uh, lot of movement, a lot of stuff going on here. Right, Get to watch my long make ready here. I decided to go this way first. I think the stage plan was solid. I wanted to get the target that you had to get over here for, and you had to get some from this corner over here. So I decided that I liked the entry. You know, the entry is a little more difficult here. Where it put the pistol for the exit was important to me. Because the next setup was much more technical and had to be in a certain area to work the way I wanted it to. So let's take a look here. Half speed. And here we go. In the position, nice soft knee. Okay, so I had this, hopefully, we have this short movement set up. So it's one wide step, my brake foot with a soft knee into my left foot where I know I need to get a little bit of weight on it to lean around that wall and so I can load it up to push out of position. Now this entrance here is a little slow because I got to hit and rotate my whole body around but I liked shooting it from left to right because of where it put the gun for the exit. It's a hard angle so I didn't want to shoot this way and then retreat here. It made a very awkward retreat so that's why I built my entry for what was next. Play with the gun. Fortunately, you do that a couple more times. That activated a swinger back here that I shot last. That was the last target I shot. Shot. Transition, eyes first, eyes gun, move. Just drop the shoulder, run around as I come in here. I put my brake foot, which is my left foot, on the outside of the fault line. Orient my right foot so I can come in and just step up. If the targets were closer, I could have started shooting right there, but I didn't. It was a hard lean. And I did this because if you shot this array from right to left, you're stuck in this position. You really couldn't shoot anything going into position because there's nothing there to shoot. You're outside of the shooting area. So I liked the idea of coming in and shooting this array inside out to allow me to shoot into the next position on the move. Take the hard shots, two partials, back over here, straight in line with the popper. What that also did, it made this retreat a lot easier. The folks who came to this spot and shot inside, I'm uh, sorry, outside in, they shot this way and they're stuck there. Their gun's pointing this way and they had to uncoil themselves to get around the wall. And I saw some really weird gun handling. I liked the idea of being able to back straight up, drive the elbow back, put the gun right in front of my face for a reload. Come in, I just did shot it all on one leg. The targets weren't that far away, and I wanted to keep in motion and get my hips spun around. When it only went on this array here as deep as I felt I needed to to get the two shots on the inside target. Come around, just go a hair wider. Probably should have grabbed the wall to flung myself around it, but I didn't. Come into last position. Right leg's my stop leg. Nice knee bend, reaching for the fault line because I knew I needed to be there and I slid up into position so I could take the more difficult shots. If I remember correctly, that was a wide open shot Then there was a partial and a swinger down here. And you can definitely tell I shot the swinger last with a nice double. Fun stage, a lot of movement, but some nuggets to think about is you get a technical stage on movement like this for the entries and exits. 
Don't just think about your entry. How is that entry going to set up your next exit? Where is the best place to do a reload to keep my gun in a good position? If I can't score points and the gun's in a good position, good time to reload. And again, I can't stress enough. Think about how you're entering a position and how it's going to benefit you when you have to leave that position for what's next. Hope you have a couple good nuggets out of this. See you on the range at TFI Academy.